This is going to be a carrot juicing video and the results I personally have seen and just how I go about juicing. I've been juicing carrots for about four years and I want to just give some tips as well as some things that I've seen change in my body and also address different things that I've read in articles and also give some resources down in the description box if there are some things that you would like to know more about with juicing and some things maybe that I personally can't, um, I haven't studied, but there has been studies out there that show how carrot juice has benefited different health conditions and um, just a, a few different ways carrot juicing might be beneficial. I'll link those studies down in the description. Um, I just, I, I don't have any experience with some of these things that um, other people have had with carrot juicing, but I also want to share them as a resource in case you're interested in carrot juicing. I'm going to link things outside of my own experience. I'm going to link those down in the description box as a resource for you who might be interested in learning more about carrot juicing. So I want to start with saying um, I started carrot juicing um, probably more, more more like seven years ago um, just because my, my husband was into it but I wasn't fairly consistent with it and um, we we would juice, but it wasn't very consistent, and we really got consistent with it about four years ago, and um, there's been a lot of benefits that I've seen in my own life, and um, the reason that we are really um, into care juicing is because he has done a lot of study um, about carrots and their health benefits. When his mom was diagnosed with cancer, a lot of um, people look at carrot juicing as a holistic method to help maybe ease the symptoms and clear the lymph nodes. Um, uh, and, and where a lot of that toxic load can be carried in your system is in the lymph nodes. So carrot juice can help with that. And so when we started studying, when he started studying about the effects of carrot juice for cancer, it just seemed overall very beneficial for us to drink carrot juice even though um, in our own life we, we haven't been, been diagnosed with cancer. Um, but it's just really helpful for the body to, uh, to drink carrot juice. So we started drinking carrot juice and um, the number one thing that I saw right away, well, there's a lot of things that I could say could be number one, but one of the things is that my hair started growing longer than it had ever grown before. Um, really, it never went past this and it, this length, and I thought that was pretty long, but once it started growing, I was just so amazed. I've always wanted really long hair, so that's kind of a cool side effect to, to drinking carry juice, and one of the things that I've just personally think is that if carrot juice can affect your hair growth, which your body doesn't necessarily like, it, it's just like the excess proteins and things that are, are delivered to your hair. So if it's affecting my hair, it's probably affecting uh, many other parts of my body, even though I can't tell or see any results in other parts of my body. I can see the results in my hair. So I really think it's amazing to see how much hair growth I've had in the past four years. If um, if I look back on videos and pictures of me five, six years ago, my hair just never went past this length. And so it's kind of cool to see it growing. It's grown about a foot or maybe even like maybe 14 or 15 inches in the last four years. So that's kind of a cool thing to see, um, but that's not really a health benefit. Um, another health something that's maybe more on the health benefit of sides is that I feel like uh, my skin has cleared up a lot and I think that's due to how the enzymes in the fresh carrot juice, which I want to address the difference between um, fresh carrot juice and um, pasteurized carrot juice. The difference would be the enzymes. The carrot juice that's fresh has enzymes in it and by enzymes I I'm basically referring to like if you if you take a bite of an apple and let it sit on the counter it turns brown and it's oxidized and um, when you drink the fresh carrot juice you get that fresh raw uh, those enzymes that help with oxidization uh, in your blood and in other 
uh, organs in your body. If it's been pasteurized, you know, it doesn't, uh, it's, it's been preserved to where, uh, like in my apple example, it wouldn't turn brown. But if you leave this fresh carrot juice out, it, it would go bad. So just like that apple. So you, you want the fresh enzymes. Those are a little bit better. I, I also love some of the pasteurized carrot juice. I think it tastes pretty good. And sometimes I'll grab it at the grocery store, but overall I like the fresh carrot juice better because it has the enzymes in it that can help with oxidization in your blood and therefore all other parts of your body, your organs, and even that's how your hair grows. The nutrients are delivered to your hair from your bloodstream. So um, the enzymes in the fresh carrot juice, in my opinion, are a little bit better than the pasteurized carrot juice. So I've noticed a difference in my hair length and the clarity of my skin. I gave up makeup two years ago, so I've also been makeup free, and I just feel like my skin has improved so much since going makeup free, but before that, even with just drinking carrot juice. So I haven't had any type of um, acne issues. I used to have some acne issues. So I haven't had any acne issues. And then the, the next health benefit that I've just noticed and seen, and I shared this in another video, is that just my digestion has been um, a lot better. Uh, the carrot juice helps with digestion a lot. Um, I drink a lot of carrot juice. And I don't recommend doing that just starting off drinking a lot of carrot juice, maybe like eight ounces a day, because it really will like flush out your system. And I don't eat a diet that's um, too specific outside of carrot juice. I don't replace meals with carrot juice. I just drink it when it sounds good. And I drink like a blender bottle full of carrot juice. And I've, I've pretty much just like worked my way up to that amount. I wouldn't recommend doing that right away just because it can uh, work a number on your system. But it helps with digestion and it's helped with my digestion. And just um, sometimes you can feel like your body is a little bit uh, stuffy, I guess would be the right term, but it helps with any type of uh, constipation and also I mentioned um, cleaning out your lymph fluid. If you haven't looked up lymphatic drainage and lymph fluid and how your lymph system works, it's, it's kind of a cool study to look at, especially if you're interested in biology, but carrot juice can help clear the lymph fluid and it just basically removes any excess fluid in your body that might even have toxins in it. I mentioned cancer has a lot to do with the lymph system and just holding on to those toxins in your body and, and it has a hard time removing those, but the carrot juice can, can help with that. Um, at least that's what I've read in some of the studies I will link down below. So having my lymph system kind of cleaned out with the carrot juice and also just my digestive system, I feel a little bit better, more energetic and just maybe more um, fluid myself where I can uh, get up and go and I don't feel like there's something wrong in my body um, with with the, uh, just holding on to food or, or having any type of congestion. I don't, I don't experience any of those symptoms any longer and I, I, I know it might seem strange like what is she actually saying maybe but um, overall I'm just saying it helps with any type of constipation and also any type of blocked lymph nodes and and clearing out your lymph system um, so that's that's what I've noticed in my personal experience with carrot juice and that's why I continue to drink carrot juice because I know it really helps me with that now I want to <sighs> Okay, there, there was something else that I wanted to mention, especially in this video with carrot juice, and that is um, who knows why the reasons my husband and I were praying for a long time to be able to have a baby and conceive, and we were able to do it after the two-year mark of juicing consistently, and I don't know if that is like the reason or, or what it is. Overall, God just has the right timing, I believe, but allowing your body to have the right nutrients and to really fill it with um, with those good nutrients that are in the carrot juice and other foods of course I think allows your body kind of preps your body to be pregnant 
and um, there's a lot involved with with nutrition and you know folate and vitamin A there's been some studies on carrot juicing and pregnancy and being able to get pregnant and even PCOS so um, in my experience yes I was carrot juicing a lot when I got pregnant and um, I'm not saying that's the reason why because there's been no scientific study done. I, I didn't do a scientific study on this. There's no control. But I, I feel like it did help at least with the pregnancy because my body was really nourished with the carrot juice. And um, I was also juicing spinach and other things. So I feel like that um, at least helped it. Like it, it didn't hurt it, but I think it, it, it could have helped that situation with being able to get pregnant. So that was kind of cool. There was a study I read about fertility and carrot juice. I'm gonna to try to link that down in the description as well. So um, there were a couple other things that I wanted to mention with, with carrot juice. Oh, I wanted to mention how I juice and how much I juice and just kind of like the pattern of juicing that we do here. And that is, um, usually I drink about 20 ounces of carrot juice about five times a week. Um, just because sometimes we just don't get to juicing, but I do it about five times a week, so that's a lot of carrot juice. But we probably do about 15 pounds of carrots per week. Thankfully, carrots haven't seen too much of an inflation. They haven't gone up this whole time I've been juicing. So it's kind of nice to know that carrots aren't that expensive. If you drink as much carrot juice as I do, it might cost like $4. Um, because I also add other things to it, but if you do just carrots, it's about one pound of carrots equals about one pound of, or one cup of juice. So if you just want one cup, if you want, if you want to start with just one cup a day, that's only about one pound of carrots a day. Carrots are usually a dollar or less per pound for the organic carrots. So if you buy organic carrots, you're not going to be spending that much for one cup of carrot juice. If you buy uh, carrot juice at a juicery, you're probably spending like $9 per cup. So it's a lot more affordable to do this at home than it is to go somewhere and buy the carrot juice. And it's a lot better to do it at home and and uh, just drink it at home rather than going out and buying pasteurized like Bolt House Farms carrot juice at the grocery store, which in my opinion tastes good. It just doesn't have the enzymes in it that, that are more beneficial. So um, another thing that I wanted to mention is that when I juice these carrots, I drink it right away. I don't save it in the fridge. Um, it's kind of like that example I gave earlier about the apple. Um, when you take a bite of it and set it out on the counter, it goes bad. The same thing can, can happen with carrot juice, where if you juice it, you're, you're like splitting the you know, you're, you're basically ripping apart the juice from the pulp and then leaving it in the fridge or the counter. That's not a good idea because then it will oxidize and spoil. So it's best to just drink it right away. It tastes better and it's better for your body to absorb those enzymes that were just juiced. So I recommend juicing and drinking it right away if you do juice. And um, it's, it's pretty affordable. It's only about a dollar per cup. So that's, that's not too big of an expense when it comes to your health. And um, so that's what I do. I use the Breville Pure Fountain Cold Juicer XL. I like it. It's fairly easy to clean, but there is this juicer out there that I have kind of like my eyes set on, and that is the Pure Juicer. And the Pure Juicer is recommended by... Um, uh, I'm going to pronounce it wrong, but I think it's Gerson or Gershon. I think it's Gerson therapy, which Gerson therapy is a nutritional approach to helping cancer and curing cancer. So that's a very interesting subject and topic to look up. I'm going to link that down in the description box below because I'm not an expert on that, but I have read the articles and I've read the studies and I'm going to link that information down below for anybody who might be interested in looking that up. And um, if you are affected with cancer, which I've I've read and heard that we all have cancer cells in our body. It just depends on our our body, how how our body and our cells attack that cancer and remove it, and that's where our lymphatic system comes in. So if you're going through any of that, I I want to pray for you, and I I hope that 
um, you find healing from that. But um, it's an interesting topic, uh, the Gerson therapy. They recommend this pure juicer, which I've kind of been like eyeing for a while. It's also, it's a beautiful juicer. And so um, it's just, it's a lot pricier. Um, but I used my Breville XL Cold Fountain juicer and I enjoy that. Um, it's fairly easy to clean and it makes a lot of juice um, because we drink a lot of juice. And um, I juice other things as well, but my main uh, thing that I juice is carrots and uh, organic carrots just because I try to avoid any excess uh, sprays or chemicals or GMO carrots so so I just buy organic they're they're still fairly inexpensive okay so let's see what else did I want to say hmm. oh I wanted to talk about what I eat with carrot juice. I eat a fairly clean diet, but I'm I'm not like fanatic about it. We'll get we'll eat frozen pizza or we'll we'll eat other foods too. I'm I'm uh, pretty flexible with that. I just incorporate carrot juice into my diet on top of um, just whatever we eat. We try not to buy too many processed foods, so most of the foods that we do eat are pretty. Um, what you would find in nature and then we just combine them with seasoning and make it delicious so um we do eat pretty clean but i'm not afraid to you know go out and get pizza or or a burger or whatever so um i don't feel like you have to eat uh super uh like just only juice or or do only juice and salad i think a broad range with with being moderate in things is is a better a lifelong plan for, for nutrition. Um, but I do usually, uh, if I have carrot juice, sometimes I'll have like a little snack also with that. Oftentimes it's like pecans or walnuts or, you know, bread and butter or, or something to go with the carrot juice. That's just my personal, uh, what I like to do. It's kind of nice to have a little snack with that. Maybe it's the mixture of, um, the nutrients that are in the carrot juice. Maybe some of the nutrients of those other foods that I eat all combined together. It just makes me feel better to have maybe a handful of pecans or whatever with the carrot juice. So I, I usually have a little snack with the carrot juice when, when I have a carrot juice. And, um, oh, what else was I going to say? My whole thought with making this video is basically if I were to sit down across from a friend and talk to them about carrot juice, this is this is the type of video that I wanted to make and share with other people. I feel like there's a lot of people that are interested in carrot juicing and overall just trying to help their body the best way they can. I take life as more in more of a holistic approach where it's not just one thing that is going to drastically change your life. I don't feel like that is unless there is one thing that will drastically change your life and my opinion on that is that it's brokenness and humility before God and asking him to help you. Um, so that will drastically change your life but that in turn will affect other areas of your life. So. Um, as far as just like one thing, whether it's juicing or something else, exercise, will it drastically change your life? I don't think so. I think it's a multitude of things all combined together. So, um, so I, but this is one area of life I think that, that a lot of people are interested in and I wanted this to be kind of like a starting ground where you can maybe find some resources down in the description box below that of links and studies that you can click on to learn more about carrot juicing. And um, there's, there's this interesting center that I found that also helps people um, with nutrition uh, that are going through some health issues. And that is the, I forgot exactly what it's called, but it's the Patrick Dempsey Center. Um, they have like nutritional resources that are really interesting and so so does the Gerson therapy They have a site that has some interesting nutrition resources for someone to look up So if there are some things that you're interested in looking up those two are, are pretty interesting and um, 
I hope that you, if you, if I missed anything and you have any questions, just comment down below in the comment section. I try to check my comments fairly often and I'll share with you anything that I know. I'm not, I'm not like an expert on any subject, but it is something, carrot juice has been something that I've implemented in my own life and I've seen results from. So I will share this personal testimony and get other information out to you if, if uh, that would be helpful to you. And I thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.